All right, what's going on everybody? It's Gaby Card Stacks. I've got roughly a truck ton of mail that I've kept over the last week. I honestly don't know how I accumulated all of this, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and just start opening. I've got a lot of stuff, um, some exciting stuff as well. So we're just gonna get right into it. I'm gonna rip this puppy open. This is from Traded Cards, who I found on Twitter. Um, there's a lot of stack sales all the time, so I thought, thought he had a lot of cool stuff. It was super cheap stuff, too, um, <clears throat> from Canada, too, which, uh, I thought the shipping was going to be terrible, but it was actually pretty nice. So I think I paid, like, 10 bucks for the stack, and there's, like, a lot of good stuff in here. So excited for this. This one came in, uh, pretty early in the week, so it was hard to, uh, hold it and such, but there we go. All right, so we'll start with, I guess, the top-loaded stuff here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right, whatever. We'll leave that. Sean Marion Refractor from 07, numbered to 999. I think this is 07. 06. Sean Marion Refractor, that is very cool. And uh, Amari Stoudemire, white. I don't know if this is numbered. I guess not, no. So I don't know what the difference is. I don't know Topps Chrome Basketball as well. Like football white chrome refractors are like to 869, and this one is a refractor to 999, but I thought that was cool. Um, that was like what kind of started my stack, and I was like, okay, cool. Um, the rest of this, I think, is just kind of low and stuff, but I'll throw it in binders, and uh, I'll just, well, this is a, oh, okay, okay. Just, uh, Old tall team bag here. Great. Oh, just cut it open. That's all right. Um, Cam Johnson orange. I want to get a Suns um, all orange. Oh my god, I think I just bought this. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Uh, I want to get a Suns all orange team page. Shout out to TV cards. Amari red, white, and blue. Aaron Gordon pink optic. That's cool. Bagley. And then, uh, oh, just a bunch of Donruss. These guys went to U of A. Um, I'll probably just do something with that. Maybe get parallels from Don Russ. And then Saban Lee went to my high school a few years after me. Um, went to Vanderbilt. He was like a three-star guard. And then uh, got drafted. So that's pretty cool. Um, so now we'll go into this. This is eBay. So let's see. So cool little stack there from, from Traded Cards. What is this? Oh, yes. Yeah, so JJ Matajevic Bowman first auto. He went to the University of Arizona. I went to, uh, I was hanging out with uh, Certified Cards, Max, um, and uh, we were talking about just Bowman, autos and such, and then I was looking at his collection. He had a Matt Jeff, you know, like, yeah, he went to U of A. And then uh, he got suspended for, um, for PEDs or steroids or whatever, so he's kind of, I don't know his status, but... Figured for, it was like six bucks, so. Bowman first auto, he was in AAA, um, and he went to U of A, so. That was cool, he was one of my favorites, like him and him and Newman, um, I didn't know Matajevic, but he was always kind of a, I don't know, he just had the swagger to him. Okay, what is going on here? Okay, the team bag is, is ripped, so we're just gonna pull it up, there we go, all right, cool. Um, so yeah, I just like the way Metajevic played. He just kind of has a swagger. So here, Topps Chrome X Fractor, uh, Gronk. I don't remember what year this is. They all look similar, 2012. So when I was with Certified Cards, aka Max, um, he was like, "You should do all the Gronk X Fractors." So I went on eBay that night and uh, started searching them all. So I think they all might be here. I don't know. I don't think they'll. They're all here. I think I checked some shipping stuff and. Um, that was not the case, so we'll see. But hopefully I get to complete most of it. Um, I know the last part here is the, the big 2010 rookie. So that's what I've been super excited about. That here is super fast. So uh, this is uh, eBay. Yes, this is eBay. Ah, Kevin Newman. Oh, scotch tape. Nice. Um, Kevin Newman purple. Oh, goodness. All right. Oh, oh, haha. At least I did this. When they when you do add the little latch, it is easy to pull out, but 
whatever. So Kevin Newman Purple 2021 numbered to uh, 299, 292 of 299. I'm going to do the rainbow. I think I've got them all except for green and blue. They just don't exist. They've never been sold on eBay. Um, don't not listed on anywhere. Um, so that sucks. Numbered like 150 is blue and then 99 is green. So those are the last two that I'm missing and I'll have that. So I love this photo of Kevin too. Very cool. He always has cool photos in, in tops. So I like that. Alrighty. Okay, this is a tough. They taped all sides of this PWE. So yeah, I've been I've been going crazy for sure, but it's all kind of low end stuff. I've been like two bucks. Let's see. This was like two bucks, five bucks. This stack was like 10 shipped from Canada, which was nice. That was like two bucks. So um, just super low end PC stuff that I've kind of been wanting. So nice to just get it all out of the way. Um, oh, Alec Thomas. Yeah. So again, I guess certified cards was a bad influence this weekend. We were just talking about Bowman prospects. I'm like, what do you think of Alec Thomas? Like, I don't know. I don't think he's that great, but he's got, like, a lot of hype. I think he's, like, in the top 40 for prospects. And he's like, yeah, I don't believe in it, but, um, you know, I'll buy it because there's hype around it. And it's relatively cheap. So I think I got this for, like, 8 bucks, so that looks pretty nice. Just hold on to that until he gets called up, basically. Another PWE here from eBay. Ah, yeah. This is a, kind of a random one. Um, I'm doing a 2017 Prism Silver set, I guess. And so I found this Tyreek Hill for a buck. I like Tyreek, one of my favorite players. I should probably get one of his rookie cards. Um, just one of my favorite players. So <clears throat> wanted to throw him in the binder here. This, okay, yeah, this is um, from my buddy Mitch. Um, MP, MP12, uh, I, I always forget his Twitter name, MP, Cincy12, MP12, underscore, something around there, but he told me he was, uh, sending me some stuff, so, let us see, oh boy, I like that, I've been, uh, okay, Mitch, what did you do here, ah, okay, this, oh, this is sweet, oh, taped again, okay, I see what you did here. All right, so this is sick because I do have a stack with uh, like LeBron's sports cards locker or something on Twitter. And I've been getting just a bunch of throwback like Mike Bibby. Um, I'm trying to think. I can't even think. Why can't I? Oh, Richard Jefferson, like Andre Iguodala. I've been getting a bunch of throwback stuff. So, oh, this one's sick. Um, Andre Iguodala, Bowman rookie, Arizona jersey. Very cool. And then tops chrome. Oh my, wait, that's a rookie? Yo, that's sick. College, Arizona. So part of the, ooh, Bibby was part of the national championship team. I think Igudala was, um, he, okay, yeah, he, he didn't, he wasn't part of any of the championship teams. Um, oh, here we go. Chase Budinger. Now he's like an all pro, like beach volleyball guy. Super cool rookie card from upper deck. That'll go in the binder, probably all three of those together. And then Edgar and James. This is a thick boy. This is sick. I don't know what set is this. Tops DPP. I don't know what that is. That's pretty cool. Very thick. Edgar and James, throwback. Um, I, was he on the Super Bowl team? I don't... He might have been the running back when they were... In, I know Tim Hightower was there, but I don't remember. I think he was with Kurt Warner and, and that whole gang. So very cool. I love, love, love that. So thank you, Mitch. One of my uh, early supporters of the channel here. So this is sick. I got this from Com C. Um, I guess I can flip it over. I got this from Com C. Um, won it on auctions on like Tuesday night and it got here like Thursday. So very cool. Nolan Gorman, um, Bowman Chrome Refractor. PSA 9, got it for like 25 shipped, which was awesome, and the fact that it came in like three days from PS or from Com C is even better. Um, I bought a lot of Nolan Gorman at a show over Labor Day, um, 
And then like a few days later, I saw someone selling a PSA 9 refractor for like 34 bucks. I'm like, wow, that seems super cheap. That's what I paid for a lot of like five Bowman Chromes. Like I'd rather have the one PSA 9 refractor than just base Chrome. Um, and then I looked and that was even high on comps. These were going for like 25, 26 bucks. Got this for 25 this week. So I'll just get rid of my other base and then just hold that. He signed with the University of Arizona um, and then opted to go um, pro uh, once he got drafted. I think he was in the first round. So don't blame him, but I remember that was a big deal. Um, he's from Phoenix and then signed with Arizona and then just opted to go to the draft, which... You know, can't blame him, but um, I'll just kind of uh, inherit him as someone who went to U of A. Oh, this is cool. Um, Carly Lloyd, Tricolor Select. So I have um, Alex Morgan in the Tricolor. I have it in an SGC 9 that I got at the National. Um, this one I just picked up raw. Carly Lloyd played her last game ever a few weeks ago. Um, and so my wife is a huge women's national team fan, so... Um, thought that was cool to have. Think it's I got it super cheap, way under comps. Like this was, and there were a bunch of watchers. I don't know why it wasn't sold. It was after she already played her last game, um, and there was a graded. I think there was a ten of this for like seventy bucks that I should have got um, two games before her last game. But uh, yeah, this one had a bunch of watchers on it, and I mean it's not like super great condition. Yeah, but. It was like 10 bucks and then the rest of them were all like 30 bucks by it now so thought that was cool and uh i like this select soccer set um and i already have the uh uh who do i have already alex morgan i have the alex morgan already so um, thought that was cool um so what is this aha uh -huh. gronk 2011, 2011, I think is my favorite set. Um, and so there's part two of the X Fractors. Again, I think I picked that up for like two, three bucks. So super cool. So there's both of those together. So we've got two out of the six so far that I need. Actually, I already had one of them. I already had one. I think I have like 2015 or 14, I don't remember, but um so i guess that's three out of six technically i don't know what this is oh now i do um again kind of just a random miscellaneous lot just all suns tops chrome stuff base um he has them in individual or all in one top loader cool so yeah just a collection of sun stuff and actually is this where i got the uh, red white and blue let's see it is yep yeah, oh, I bought it twice, whatever. I didn't I didn't know I got it in that original stack, but whatever. These were all like a dollar a piece, free shipping. So Amari, what, is, what year is this? 2007, so um, one probably one of the great years. That was when I was in seventh grade. So maybe uh, one of the Western Conference final years, I don't remember, but Amari, Nash, Diao, Marion, Leandro, and then Amari, red, white, and blue, which I just opened up, but that's okay. Um, okay, this one. This was a trade. I forgot what I traded. What did I trade? What did I trade? Uh, oh, I traded something from Heritage. Or, uh, yeah, so the Vine card. Shout out. What is this? Oh, that's kind of cool. Jackie Robinson art. That's kind of cool. I'm going to throw that there. Um... Yeah, we did a trade. I opened up, uh, I opened up a hobby box of Heritage again with uh, certified cards max, and um, yeah, we made a trade. I don't remember what it was. Uh, oh, oh, oh! Uh, I think it was Josh Young or Justin Foskew. Justin Foskew. Um, so yeah, he's a he's a Rangers guy. Oh my goodness, there it is. Okay, oh, he taped it on the inside. The, okay, I need to know what... Oh, he just did a FedEx. I'm, I don't know, maybe, whatever. Um, this was pretty cool. Isaiah Simmons, uh, field level, silver, rookie. One of my favorite Cardinals. To watch. I don't, I'm not a fan of the Cardinals, but because they're always on every week... I can't get this tape off my finger. Because they're always on every week, I watch. So, 
Okay, I know what this one is. Last mail day, I had a Gary Brightwell uh, from Prestige. It was not in a top loader. This one suspiciously feels like there's no top loader again. I even, when I felt it, I was like, maybe I bought it from the same seller. Like maybe I just didn't see it the first time, but this one doesn't feel like it's in a top loader. So this would be kind of funny if this card is not in a top loader as well. Okay, it is, it is, okay. Yeah, the way it, it kind of sat in there. He did use scotch tape, though. Um, I forgot what parallel this is. Um, and they don't say it here, which is annoying. Um, but yeah, I got that for like a buck. So um, trying to complete kind of as many parallels as I can for him. Not one of my favorite players. Um, kind of a weird recruitment process with him, but ended up being pretty good. Got drafted in, I think, the sixth round to the Giants. So... I don't, I think he's only played like week three. I just read an article, like how Arizona guys are in the pros right now. And uh, yeah, I think he hasn't played since week three. So that's okay. He's got time. Yeah. Okay, this is, this is stuck. Okay. Oh, they taped it to the inside. This is a trend. Okay. Okay, there we go. What is this? Oh, Gronk. For my character. Boom. So, piece four. So, yeah, and what's annoying is I, I bought one, like, last week, and it, the shipping label has been created, um, but it has not been, like, there's no movement. So, there we go. Three out of the four in hand right here. I have one more somewhere in my PC box over there. Um, and... Uh, so that's four, and then this last package will be the last one. I don't know what this is. Let us see. Oh, oh, this is so sick. I love this card. Um, so I'm a big Rich Rod guy. I covered Rich Rod, worked in, for, for some of the coaches there when I was at Arizona, um, like Charlie Ragel, Dante Williams, Miguel Rovelez. Um, helped them a lot with recruiting and stuff. Um, was around Rich Rod all the time. Was around the team all the time. Um, really, really liked Rich Rod and everything. So, saw this auto. Thanks, Coach Rod. Especially just because of where the program has been in the last three years. Um, under Kevin Sumlin. And then now they have the longest losing streak. I think it's up to 19, maybe 20. Um, so, thought this was cool. A lot of people... Um, well, actually, like a week ago, that report that like got Rich Rod fired, um, you know, they, they ended up settling. So, yeah, so that kind of sucks. I mean, I do think towards the end, like it wasn't going well, but I don't know. People do miss Rich Rod. They underrate his Fiesta Bowl um, season and all of that stuff. It was with the previous coaching staff's guys. So who knows? Austin Hill, I think, was there for two years under Rich Rod, but thought this was cool got it for like five bucks so this one i'll throw in a one touch thanks coach rod there was another one and i think it was numbered but it was thanks coach rod for everything but i wasn't gonna pay 10 more bucks for for everything um so i just like to thanks coach rod um really enjoyed my time working with the program under him um, so thought that was a cool piece and now this is the big boy Hoo -hoo, hoo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Um, I think the largest, the largest purchase I've ever made for a PC card, for sure, actually. Um, yeah, definitely, definitely. But, you know, something that's uh, kind of timeless, you know, he's the greatest tight end of all time. Um, I've been looking at this card. Um, this guy didn't respond to any of my, I sent out like four, three, three, four offers and didn't respond to any of them. They all expired. And I don't know, I was getting nervous because his was already lower than everybody else, but he had best offer available. Um, and all the other listings were like 160 plus. All the comps were like 150. Some get, you know, a, a, a hundred at auctions. Um, but this one, I just decided to uh, to take a chance. Oh, actually, he ended up messaging me and he was like, hey, sorry, I've been super busy. Um, been super busy, um, you know, I would do 110. I've gotten offers around 110, but, 
I would do that if, if you're okay with it. Now, I had already sent an offer for 110. He was like, I'll accept it. Um, however, I do need to disclose that somewhere in the corners, there's like, I don't know. Somewhere in the corner, he was like, you can just kind of tell it didn't print out right. I'm trying to trying to see. He said it was on the X-Fractor side. I, I mean, it's off-centered, top to bottom. And kind of left to right there. I don't know. I'm so quiet because I'm trying to focus here. Maybe it's that top left, I guess, but I mean, that's not even that bad. Like I'm not gonna grade it anyways, so. Um, surface looks okay. Yeah, so it's just that, that top left corner, I guess, but it's honestly not even that bad. I don't even care. I'm not gonna grade it or anything. I guess, yeah, now you can kind of see it, but I don't care. This is, uh, what I wanna do is get uh, like the six piece screw down and then uh, have them all. I'll have to go grab that other one. Oh, not Tyreek. Um, boom, so yeah, I've got five out of the six. That other one I don't think has shipped, but wow, this is a 21 minute video. So that's my mail day. Just uh, quickly shuffle through these, I guess, but Super cool to have this card. Um, glad Max kind of convinced me, Tyreek, Alex. Um, I should have the rest of the pieces coming in for that Kevin Newman rainbow. I'm excited for that. Matajevic, uh, traded cards, nice PC binder stuff. Super cool tops, chrome. Love this card. This is one of my favorite cards um, just for, for the purpose of the thanks coach rod. Um, Suns, duplicate there. Gary, trade, um, PC, I'll get rid of all my Gorman base now, and then super cool binder stuff from Mitch, so that is all, um, I don't know, I guess until next, oh, actually, setting up at a show next week with Max, um, so that'll be fun, so maybe I'll, uh, do some, some stuff there, I really don't have anything of value to, to contribute to him, it's just gonna be him, I'm just driving him there, really, um, and him selling his stuff. I've got some stuff that I might try to move, but otherwise I'm of no use. I, I provide no value to the table. So um, maybe I'll do some content for that and maybe pick up some things at the show. And then uh, maybe we'll have a, another mail day, complete the Gronk X-Fractor, and then uh, complete that Kevin Newman rainbow as well. Very cool. I love that photo. So that is all. Um, until next time.